Hi guys, I hope you're all doing well. So you may have already noticed from the background of this video that I am now in the new apartment. You may have already seen as well that there's been a couple of moving vlogs and stuff going up. So let me know what you think of the new place. I have only shown you an apartment tour that's empty so far, but hopefully you like it and there will be a full kind of room tour going on. So we're only doing the bedroom and the bathroom as a tour, but that will be going up kind of when we've finished all the little bits and pieces that we need to do because it looks really presentable now but there is kind of things that are just like shoved in drawers and we haven't really looked at so once all of that is sorted we will be filming the bedroom tour expect it probably in the next three or four weeks after fashion week and everything's out of the way but that is not what this video is about this video is about boohoo because i actually was kindly gifted some pieces by boohoo about a week ago and i wanted to show you what i got because everything that i picked i obviously picked myself and i wanted to kind of go for things that were perfect for the autumn season but kind of in keeping with my very like minimal basic capsule style wardrobe because you already know that I don't own the biggest amount of clothes ever and I do have a fairly minimal style so I just thought I'd share with you these pieces which are kind of my top picks from the Newing collection and everything in this haul is actually really inexpensive which is kind of typical of Boohoo they're not really a mega pricey brand they're very affordable and I think the most expensive thing was from their boutique range which was £50 so you're going to see why it was £50 and you're going to fall in love with it but I've left it till the last thing in this video just because I know that you're all going to go crazy for it because I know that already wearing it around the streets and stuff like I've had people ask me where it's from I've had friends ask me where it's from and everyone seems to love it so I'm gonna go straight in with the other most favorite item of mine which is actually these boots these are 32 pounds I believe it might be 35 I can't remember but they're just these really nice studded boots which are absolutely everywhere at the moment I've seen these on ASOS I've seen them in Topshop I've literally seen them everywhere but these are Boohoo versions which are about half the price of the ASOS ones and I really like them they're just as good quality they're not genuine leather but they are really sturdy they're really comfortable and I wore them to the flower market the other day and they didn't hurt my feet at all I kind of thought they might be a bit stiff to break in because with chunky boots where there's not much movement they're always a bit of a challenge but these are mega comfortable and they've got the zip to get in so you don't have to undo all the straps and I just think they're really cute they're kind of like a designer dupe and they're just a classic really they are just perfect for an autumn wardrobe and I think they actually look really great if you style them with like a skirt or a dress or something a bit more feminine or you could just wear it with a really plain outfit and have the shoes do the talking because they're just such a statement piece and £32 is such a good price that you kind of can't go wrong with something like that. Then I kind of stepped out of my comfort zone a little bit, which you know I love to do with these haul videos recently, and picked up this skirt, which is actually a little bit too big, so I'm going to be sending it back because I picked up an 8 instead of a 6, and I really should have gone for a 6. But it's just a really nice kind of high-waisted, tied style, really cute. The tie is actually not real, so the skirt won't go flipping up in the wind or anything. It is secured down with stitching, but it's just a really nice like wraparound detail, and I really, really liked the the kind of soft blue stripes because blue stripes are a classic year round they kind of never go out of style and it's just a really simple feminine style that you could wear with like a chunky jumper maybe even the boots if you were feeling bold or you could just wear them with whatever you feel like wearing them with and it's the kind of skirt that can go for summer stuff or you can wear it with like autumn winter wardrobes which you know I love a chunky jumper and some boots as much as the next girl so that is kind of what I'm thinking of wearing that with when I switch the size up. Moving on, the next thing again, being on the shorter side, this is a little bit long for me, but I'm going to take it up because I really, really love it. And it's just this smock dress, which I kind of laughed at Adrian about because I looked a bit like a Victorian school child when I wore it because it's a little bit long. But if I got it shortened, it'd be perfect. And it's just this really simple smock dress with the really nice kind of green embroidery on the top. Dark green is a colour that I'm really, really loving for this autumn. I think it's going to be a huge colour. It's definitely a beautiful one to have in the palette if you've got like mustards and like kind of deep red tones and I just really liked this I thought it was a cute little detail I love the kind of smock dress style the way it kind of is loose fitting because skater styles haven't really been a thing for quite a while now and I feel like the smock dress has kind of taken over it's great if you want something oversized and you just kind of want to show off your legs because if you are flat chested like me then you know that legs is what it's all about and the sleeves as you've already seen are this kind of cute layered detail so they've got a the little bit of frill on the top and then the sleeve is a bit longer so it kind of comes to about my elbow which is a really nice length but I do tend to fold it over one just so that it looks a bit more kind of feminine because because I think where I'm a little bit shorter it just looks nicer having it rolled up a tiny bit. Then the next thing I got was some loafers which you know I'm loving my kind of loafers and mules and like little babushi kind of shoes at the moment and these are really cute. I can't for the life of me remember how much they were but they're just really sweet and they also come in like a nice dusty pink colour and it's just these really simple kind of babouche style shoes which have the little studded detail here and the oversized tassel which 
I thought were really cute. They remind me of kind of like a Moroccan style and I really like the faux suede. I think they'd be so perfect for on holiday or even just wearing around in the autumn winter. And they're also the kind of style where, I don't know if you can see here, but they're the style that you kind of can push down and wear like this as well. So you can wear them as kind of like a, a mule if you wanted to. I just really like these. I'm obsessed with them. I do need to get some insoles because they are a little tiny bit too big, but I really like them. And I think I might get the pink colour because I think it'd be a really nice statement if you're wearing like a chunky like white or dark knit jumper. And then the last thing I got, which is my absolute favorite of this entire video, and I know you guys are gonna absolutely love, is this teddy fur coat, which teddy fur is a big trend for the autumn winter season, and it's kind of set to be absolutely everywhere. It's been in vogue, it's been all over the high street, it's literally everywhere you look at the moment is teddy fur. It kind of made a debut last autumn, but didn't really come in in full force, whereas this year I think it's gonna be absolutely huge, and I think you're gonna find it everywhere. But this particular one was £50 in the boutique, like I mentioned, and I'm so obsessed with it. I kind of can't wait till it gets a little bit matted so it looks a bit more teddy bear-like. But it's just this gorgeous kind of aviator-style jacket, really oversized, really, really, really cosy. I've been snuggling up in this every day since I got it, and I just absolutely love it. It's got the really nice silky lining, and the kind of oversized fit which I think is perfect and I also kind of liked the rose gold detailing because it's nice and subtle it doesn't really stand out or anything against the colour of the fabric. So this is actually available in this kind of camel colour but it's also available in a dark green which was sold out when I got this one hence getting this colour because I did contemplate the dark green but I absolutely love it. I can't tell you how cosy it is and how warm it is. Adrian's even tried it on because he thought it was the nicest thing ever and it's just super, super cosy and £50 is such a good price for a winter coat, especially one like this. It's going to keep you really snuggly and even though it is a really warm jacket, I kind of can't wait to put it with like jumpers and stuff underneath because it's just mega, mega snuggly and it's been keeping me toasty as anything for the last few days. So that's the end of this Boohoo haul. I really hope you like this video. I'm sorry it wasn't a try on. I just didn't have time with moving house. I filmed this video the second we got here and just wanted to get it up for you guys so that you're not missing anything because I'd hate to mess up my schedule because of moving house. But our internet is coming hopefully in about two days time so there should be regular uploads from then and I should be able to get back on track because obviously moving is such a big palaver that it kind of throws you off a little bit. But I really hope you enjoyed all the moving content and I hope you enjoyed this vlog. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, all that jazz, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.